Brad Spinners and Sharks just got the new update for My Vegas Slots. Let's see what's in store for us. It's the Ace of Vegas, the Ace of Vegas. All right, Spinners and Sharks, so here we are. We're going to be playing a little bit of Riches of Zeus today. Now, this is actually a unique uh, My Vegas game here in that it can be played horizontally or it can be played vertically. So you can actually play this game in portrait mode. I'd have to kind of change the way the uh, the game in the LD player is situated, but if that is something that you want to do on the emulator, you actually can play in portrait mode on LD player. I'll leave a link to that in the description box down below if you want to download it for yourself. That'd be, uh, you know, just, just as another option, alternative to blue stacks, if you will. Uh, but yeah, that being said, uh, let's drive straight into this, see what it's like. Rich as Zeus. Oh man, this thing is designed for a YouTube short over here. Maybe I should just make this video a YouTube short, I don't know. But anyway though, we are looking at our bet line over here. We're starting with 6,701,457,922 chips. And let's see what we can do to get, how much would we have to bet to get a grand down here? Oh, it'll let you click and turn the device sideways. All right, well, that's kind of neat. And then let's uh, click and turn it back vertically too. Okay, all right, that's pretty cool. Let's see if we can turn that grand on here. All right, that takes quite a bit to get through the grand jackpot there. Maybe we won't do that because that's only gonna give us like 12 spins here. We are gonna bet 22 million per spin. So we're gonna do 22,750,000 per spin. And we're gonna do that a hundred times. So that'll in total put 2.2 billion chips through the machine. And then, uh, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and see how this goes. So let me go get my clicker out. We're gonna put a hundred spins on the clock, on our marks, get set, ready, and go. All right, guys, so this, uh, this contest is going, I think for another day here. This will be up Monday. And it is currently, I believe, Sunday, Bloody Sunday, as I'm recording this. Actually, I think it is, come to think of that. So, make of that what you will. Oh, oh, that was fast. We already got an achievement. So that's nice. Just in the first five spins. Oh, I kind of like this. So, I guess as you go through Mount Olympus here... and you lightning bolt some of the clouds away, it gives you some extra bonuses on top of that. Wow, this is actually kind of cool, I like this. We got some pretty serious lightning power here. Let's go Zeus. <laughs> awesome, look at that win, look at that win. Okay, then it brings the clouds back. Okay, that's cool. So I guess if you get a certain amount of those, it'll give you a certain amount of thunderbolts to drop. The master bolt, if you will. I was a big Percy uh, Percy Jackson fan when I was in junior high school and high school and all that. It was a good time. Pity about that movie. The movie didn't go so well. But yeah, this has got me thinking about Vegas and getting back to Caesar's Palace, even though that's an amalgamation of different... You know, different Roman and Greek architecture in addition to some kind of modern art deco architecture too. But I do love the fact that that is one of the oldest hotels on the Strip and it is still one of the best. Like they really kept up with their models, they kept refreshing it, they kept it clean, and that was the important thing. So I was actually very impressed last time I popped in. Here we go. Oh, come on, one more! One more fist! Oh, darn it. That's three. Alright, that was one. So it's one bolt, two bolts, three bolts, four bolts. Let's see what matches up. Oh, fifth bolt over here. Let's go. Oh, that's the three times. So we take our win, multiply it by three. Alright, I like this feature. The game really wants me to bet more to win more, doesn't it? 
Oh, the wilds have a little more power too. Ah, that's kind of neat. So it keeps re-triggering there. I like that. Oh, I wonder if I can clear this whole thing now. Ooh, that's seven times. Come on now. Ah, oh, three times. That's not bad, though. That's not bad. Come on. All right, so that's the two times there. So that's going to be a total eight times on that one. And 105... Yeah, 105 million. Yeah, there's just a lot going on in this game. All right, guys, so I think... You know what I'd like to hear about? What's everybody's favorite pool right now? Last time we did the podcast, I was wondering about pools and all that. And pool season is back in full swing. They're bringing back the pool parties and all that. Uh, Mandalay, Delano pools coming back in March. And actually, it is March. So by the end of the month, pretty much all the pools are going to be reopened. So that's actually really awesome because I go to Vegas for the pools. Uh, Wonder Woman's definitely big on pool uh, pool time, too. And uh, she's definitely looking forward to going this pool season. So we're all pretty hyped about that. All right. Oh, can this extend? Do we extend? 2.1 million. All right. So it looks like anytime we get a win down here, it extends. And then we get a couple bolts up this way. Excellent. Excellent. And it starts kind of acting towards these mini jackpots here. There we go. And that gives us an extra lightning bolt. Dude, look, because I just got all the symbols, the eagle and the wine glass and all that. This is this is premium <laughs> Greek mythology. At least cartoonized, you know. There we go. Another hundred million. Two hundred million. Nice. Loyalty points well spent. There go those wilds. Oh, here we go, guys. More wilds. So there's a two times. Oh, we got that minor jackpot. That 200 million chip my minor jackpot. And do we get a multiplier on top of that? That's yet to be seen. Or is that separate from the win? Okay, cool, cool. So that's separate from the win. That's not bad, though. That's not bad. I've got to keep clicking to keep this. Oh, whoa, hold up. All right, so we got two thunder hands here. Are we going to get that major? No. Okay, we got the two times. The major would be wild. So two times one on that one. I feel like we should have gotten an extra thunderbolt here. Oh, I like that the, the more you win, the more it stacks up. Oh, we got the major 450 million on one spin. Not bad, not bad. Dang, that was great. So as long as we keep these clouds clear, we're doing just fine there. Got a little bit of lightning there. Too bad we don't have the grand activated. We totally could have. Oh, what's going on here? If we get another fist, what happens? Oh, shoot. What's going on now? Okay. Okay, that's cool. Bonus game. All right, let's see what the bonus is on this one. We rarely get to see the bonus trigger. All right, not bad, not bad. Okay, so it brings the clouds back for a minute. Okay, so we get to clean out a little bit of this. Get us uh, a little closer to the top levels here. There we go, extra lightning bolt there. Hopefully we line something up. Uh, we're right about the halfway mark here. Oh, 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 did we get a re-trigger? No, we don't. You gotta get three more of them to get a re-trigger.
All right, 30 million in the free, 38 million in free spins. Okay, that covers us for the next couple spins here. Let's go, let's go, and keep it going. All right, spinners and sharks. But what's your favorite pool? I'd like to hear about your favorite pool right now. I know we talked about that, but let's also hear about your favorite themed pool, like your favorite hotel themed pool. Like, do you prefer Caesar's Palace over Bellagio, or do you like the theming at Luxor? Do you enjoy Flamingo's pool? I know they've got that kind of nature reserve, tropical style on top of it, and I dig it. I personally dig it. Flamingo's got a really underrated pool. Can we get more free spins? No, we cannot. We have not earned that. That was a good hit. Good hit. I've been thinking about Caesars a lot lately, especially with their buffet going uh, the way of the dinosaurs, especially since they, they spent a lot of money remodeling, and I peeked in there, and I did see that they were doing some remodeling on there. In fact, I'm going to sneak in a clip of that. Take a look. So they're doing some new exciting improvements. The rumor is that they're replacing Bacchanal with something completely different, maybe something similar to Wynn's setup here. We're not getting a good peek in there, but it does look like it's still relatively standard. So, But despite that remodeling, they don't seem to be reopening it anytime soon. And on the earnings call, uh, the CEO of Caesars said that they weren't planning on reopening casinos. That's a bit of a shame. That is a bit of a shame. Oh, come on, come on. Oh, we thought, thought we had that minor. Let's get that. All right, three times isn't bad. Three times is pretty good. It's something. Yeah, this is definitely one of those games that you gotta build yourself up on over a long period of time, I see. But once you start winning, you start winning very clearly. Oh, hold up. So that's a five times bonus. Cool, 10 million. That's still half my bet. That's still half the bet. But at least we're making some progress here. Ah, uh, dang, we got the clouds back. Gotta clear the clouds. So much for being god of the skies here. There's another question. Who will win the fight? Thor or Zeus? What do you guys think? I guess it depends on if we're talking about comics or if we're talking about mythology. I think being the uh, Sky Father gives Zeus a little bit of an a little bit of an edge as far as overall power levels go, but Oh! Hang on, one more fist! One more Fist of Lightning. Ah, uh, no Master Bolt on that one. Ah, uh, really feel like that uh, helmet should have counted for something. Alright, that's something. Okay, that opened it up a little bit. Gave us a few more chips here just to keep us afloat. That's very much how slot machine play just seems to go in general. This is very much giving me some vibes of being on the strip right now. Because that's just kind of how slot machines go. On the strip especially. Boom, there we go. Oh, we got a lot of lightning dropping because we had a full set Coming up on our last few spins here that we're doing. Yeah, these high bets were, uh, they're good when you're winning, but you know, they're terrible when you're losing. That's just how it is. Nothing special there. Another good hit, another good hit, come on. Not, uh, okay, 3.1, that's workable. We need to get up there one more time. There it is. There we go. Bust us into the... Okay, that's a two times. Bust us into the minor bonus. Oh, that was so close. Three times. So we got to get one more in a row if we actually want to win something on this. Yeah, that's what he keeps saying. Almost there. All right. Let's keep it going. Oh, do we get a win? Do we get a win? Do we get a win? Oh, Oh wait, hang on, we got a little lightning on that one. Nah, nothing. If we can get one more set of free spins. One more set of free spins, come on! Oh, no dice.
Still not sure what the pluses and minuses denote. These are our last few spins here, guys. I think we've got six more to go after this. Yep. Last five. We gotta get something out of it. We gotta get something out of it. Oh, we got a win on that one. That's good. We get one more chain like this. Oh, come on. No way, no way, no way, no way. Oh, yeah, I didn't think so. And there's something. Did we get a multiplier? Ooh, give us the five times. So I thought this was going to be on a minor jackpot. It just hits on whatever you hit, so that's kind of neat. Oh, there we go. We got some lightning. We got another win on that one. Let's go. So that's the times two. That's the times, hopefully a times four. Times three. All right, and that's a 12 times, or total 12. All right, let's get it. Come on, give us one more. All right, that was a win there. All right, that's a two times bonus. That's another one. Okay, 28. No, 30 million, 30 million. Oh, two bolts. Oh, we're, oh shoot, that miner though. That miner jackpot though. Oh man, we can't stop now. We gotta do that last safety spin. Last safety spin, come on, give us something good. Ah, that was it, guys. All right, Spinners and Sharks, so it looks like we're gonna be ending at 6,555,974,172 chips. So let's take a quick break here. I'm gonna do some maths and we'll uh, count up the booty. All right there, Spinners and Sharks, all things considered, I think we did pretty good there. Uh, we did end up losing 145,483,750 chips, therefore leaving us with the uh, 6.55 or 555 billion chips and a payback percentage of 93.53%. So still not quite enough to get best games in Vegas status, as you guys know. We only award that to games that get over 100%, or at least get 100%. So still pretty close. I do like the fact that you can flip the screen. I do wish it had a horizontal mode. I might have to just check that out on my phone just to verify that I can switch it over to a horizontal mode and play it like that. But I do like the option and the way it lets you clear the clouds to get extra bonuses and lets you keep going. If it was a skill based game I think there'd probably be a way to chain that but obviously it's not it's just you know luck of the draw if you get a certain amount of symbols it's all good stuff but yeah that being said hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and then next time we'll go ahead and get back to some classic Vegas action okay there's Spinners and Sharks that's it for today's video if you enjoyed today's tutorial and found it informative I'd appreciate a like and consider subscribing if you haven't already Next time we're going to get back to the real world in the real Vegas and I'll show you how you can use the loyalty points that you got here to make your room even better. But until next time, the Ace of Vegas signing out, wishing you strong hands, and of course, happy spending you guys.